We saw Matthew Stafford lead 34 fourth quarter comeback drives during his time with the Lions, Brian. So as the Rams drove down the field in Super Bowl 56, it was familiar to all of us in Michigan. The magnitude of the win, though, completely foreign to us here. Seeing that feeling at the Super Bowl, that's what led Stafford to leave in the first place. We have seen him do it over and over. A late deficit, teammates injured, and Matthew Stafford finds a way. Got it. Sunday on football's biggest stage, he engineered the biggest comeback drive of his career. I love those kind of drives, those moments. You're sitting in that huddle and just the belief I have in the teammates that I have is, yeah. is just unwavering. I don't care what the last three quarters look like. I just believe in those guys so much and, uh, you know, we got it done. 12 years in Detroit, the Lions playoff woes. And here, in his first season with the Rams, he guides them to a Super Bowl championship. He's been called a lot of things by a lot of people. You have to call him a Super Bowl champion, and you have to call him a Hall of Famer now. On the field at SoFi Stadium, moments after the win, Stafford talked about the fans back in Michigan. It was amazing. You know, I mean, like you said, there's no reason for them to cheer for me anymore, and, and the fact that they did was just... A true testament to who they are as people and who they are as fans. Um, you know, you played in the Midwest City, you know the deal, and they uh, they live and die with those guys, their players, and to have that support all the way across the country here playing in this game means the world to me and my wife and my family. They helped us through a bunch of tough times and, uh, you know, are a huge reason I'm sitting here today. Confetti with the kids and his wife, Kelly. This is the moment the Lions imagined when they drafted him in 2009. The reality, though, Stafford does it in his new home, Los Angeles. What the Rams did... And the drive Stafford orchestrated along the way, including that impressive win over Tom Brady and the Bucks, that gave Hall of Famer Steve Young reason to say out loud what so many in the game believe now. That was a Hall of Fame four weeks, my man. Yeah, no doubt. I just want you to know that. I think it was. That was. It's all you can say about it. Thank yep, you very much. Go. Calm, cool, and collected post-game. Matthew Stafford didn't reveal a ton of his personality during his time here in Detroit when he was with the Lions. And Brian, you were just saying it. Did he realize he won the Super Bowl? I think he did. He just knows. That was the time to exhale, soak it all in, and worry about your legacy there.